and check out some young upcoming music stars already making a name for themselves. That and much more straight ahead on Next TV, change you can see. This next story is all about young, bright, and talented students who you just may be hearing about in a few years. And when you do, it'll be music to your ears. I'm inside of the Garfield Park Golden Dome on Chicago's west side. I understand that there's an unbelievable musical program here that many refer to as one of the city's hidden jewels. The idea for Chicago West Community Music Center was really born out of the need for a music school in the community. Many times when coming into uh, the West Side in particular, there was a very obvious uh, omission of programs, particularly for fine arts, music, and uh, dance, theater. Being a musician and a music educator, I felt there was something that I personally could do. I love the old saying, you know, rather than curse the darkness, light a candle. So this was my way of being able to light a candle. Howard Sanderford and his life partner lit that candle in 1999. Since then, they have seen their music program grow beyond belief. We took it upon ourselves, myself and my wife, Darlene Sandifer. We decided to form an organization where we could provide music instruction to not just school-age uh, school students, but people in the community, whoever would be interested in learning about music. We have uh, two very exciting programs. As you know, the Business of Music program is where we talk to the students about the music industry. Let's talk about uh, the organization of a record label. We talk to them about publishing, marketing, want them to understand about the legalities which are included in the business. Uh, the other program is the Berkeley Initiative, which is a partnership we have with Berkeley College out of Boston, one of the leading music conservatories in the country. Uh, we work with them in terms of providing cutting edge music uh, curriculum to our students. It's also a internet uh, web-based program where it teaches music theory and production. World-renowned jazz guitarist Michael Ross is a product of Chicago's West Side. He saw the gift that Chicago West Community Music Center was offering and wanted to contribute. Having this program, it's like a stepping stone into Berkeley College. I uh, arrange music for the students, uh, uh, help them to understand uh, the arrangements, the music, and, uh, and discuss uh, music theory. and and try to uh, get them on that level so they can be ready for uh, the business of music. The Chicago West Community Music Center has been developing musical talent since 1999. And I have the pleasure of having one of its superstars with me today, Mr. Randis Hopkins. Randis, tell me, what are you gonna jam or what are you gonna perform for us today? I'm gonna play Real 66, BG Adair's version. Randis? Uh, he's, he's someone that have really amazed me. When he first got with the program, you know, he, he could barely play a scale. He had taken on this, this thing called music, this art form, and has taken it to a whole nother level. Rennis Hopkins is one of nearly 600 students who've passed through the doors of the after-school program at Chicago West. The 18-year-old Curie High School senior has caught the eye of many in the music business, including jazz vocalist Maggie Brown. Some of the children who were uh, quite proficient in this program okay. were opening up for the concert I was doing. And then uh, once I, I had an occasion to need um, a new pianist sure. to work with me, my normal guy wasn't available. And so I asked the director of that concert, Mr. Alan Kern, who he recommends, and he okay. recommended Randis. Being able to perform, you know, with someone, you know, of her caliber, Maggie Brown's caliber, you know, it was just truly an honor. We work uh, very hard to make sure we bring excellent artists, instructors, and only the best music into this community. Uh, we don't know whether the next uh, Quincy Jones or Duke Ellington or Andre Watts or Leontine Price we don't know where they're going to be coming from. Why can't they come from this community? Don't by no means write us off on the west side. I'm truly living out my dream today with Chicago West, and the best thing is we finally discovered the hidden jewel.
We can't wait to see how all of that talent develops.